People are not gonna care about this video, but uh, to that I say. Hello, my name is New, and if you're new to this channel, welcome. And if you're not new to this channel, welcome back. Today we're going to be talking about how horrible our economic stance is right now during this pandemic, especially because how horrible our government is. Now, excuse my boob and shirt showing, I was pointing out the fact that this shirt is a crop top, but since I was wearing it for my personality type video, we're gonna just cover it up with this help me shirt for the rest of the video. <laughs> now, if you didn't know, I recorded this video a long time ago, the same day that I recorded the personality type video, but I didn't use this video because I didn't like what I was doing, so um, we're just gonna ignore that. We're gonna still use the video because I honestly like the look that I did for this video, but we're just gonna cover the shirt like I said. <laughs> and we're gonna talk about the dumb situation that I'm going through currently in the New York State. So yeah, let's talk about that. Let's start with the governor of New York. Um this governor what do i say so basically new york is broke we before the pandemic it was around about six million dollars that we were in debt and now we're in 15 million dollars in debt um also another thing is that um new york cannot pay the over 20 million people who are now unemployed and then there are some states who are forcing people to get employed because we can't we can't pay all these people another thing is our governor is not um removing not even removing um stopping like funding for certain things that currently can't be funded like buses you know like school buses like no one's going to school while you're still funding that funding that oh my god english is bad for me today too another huge thing that like is actually bothering me is the fact that they're giving unemployment to people who are did unemployment in uh april but people in march including me who done their unemployment are still pending there's like a whole bunch of people on twitter who are just complaining about not being paid in march which me included and you're probably gonna say oh if you get paid then you're not gonna be complaining blah 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 no i will continue to complain even if i get bank bank in my bank because it's ridiculous that all these people are still not getting paid and like you also were probably like, oh, you probably got your stimulus check. Ooh. Like, I did, but I wasted it in a week not buying Animal Crossing because I don't have that yet. It was because I was paying bills and that's a lot, you know? Especially if you're a broke college student who has a whole bunch of loans to pay off. Not only that, there's a whole bunch of people who don't even qualify for the stimulus check or still haven't received it and they've done their taxes a long time ago. So, um, yeah, I'm grateful that I received it, but at the same time, that did not help. I mean, how long were we supposed to use, like, a thousand, two hundred? Like, how were we supposed to spend that across three months? Like, that's nearly impossible. And also, like, what's going on like first of all the federal government was like oh we wanted to give these checks not checks but like the unemployment caused by everyone gets if they file for unemployment uh this it's six hundred dollars that you get every week they wanted to the federal to give it straight directly to the people but no um because it's a state uh thing it's every state does their own um policies and stuff for unemployment the federal government can't directly give it to the people so sucks now before you come for me i'm gonna do a few points that i didn't go across in the last two <laughs> voiceovers um but first of all we li i live in new york and new york taxes are really high 
and also the rent is really high so that alone like a studio costs more than a thousand two hundred so imagine paying rent that's all your stimulus check money is going straight to rent so yeah like how is that supposed to go across for three months also about the unemployment in people getting unemployment in april supposedly they're checking the pending cases and all the claims are supposed to go in crawl 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 they're supposed to go in order so people who started first are supposed to get like their pending case first but no it's actually whoever has done it recently is getting first and the thing is it's not just march it's also people in february who are backed up like there's a whole hashtag called pending pure jury like it's it's bad okay so final points before i end this video because it's already six minutes long I want it to be at least 10 and um, I'm probably going under that, but it's fine. It's okay. It's great. Um, so the final points that I wanted to address, I completely forgot. Wait one second. Okay, I'm back and my leg doesn't hurt. <laughs> um, but yeah, so the final points that I wanted to address was that the money that they give, they're supposed to give you, they're doing backdated. So basically, if you applied the 1st of March, they're going to have to give the money from the 1st of March all the way to now at once plus the supposed $600 that they're supposed to give you from April 5th so that's like one month of the original payment and then another month with an extra 600 that's a lot of money and multiply that by over 2 million people. Um, New York, you, you, you effed up. So this is the finished look. Looks so good. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want more videos like this, go ahead and comment it down below. And you had a great week so far and yeah see you in the next one i guess i really don't know how to end my videos so you really don't huh you really don't excuse the madness but um this was one of my earlier videos so ignore me oh. hey. where's the child where's slapping my phone in the face. Ugh.